These little green dots are micro-robots. They can navigate in a cell network and stimulate individual cells in a targeted manner. Researchers at the Technical University of Munich, or TUM, say the microbot is the first of its kind and has the potential to offer new treatment methods for patients battling cancer or other diseases. Berna Erskele Edelman is the lead researcher at TUM. We're using these microrobots to build um, tissues under synthetic conditions. And the whole point of this is to, in the future, then repair um, damaged tissue or organs um, at a really patient basis. So if I can sort of like, you know, manufacturing cars in a um, robotic uh, factory. The tiny robots are made from seaweed and the team has found a way to produce millions of them in just minutes. They are about half the width of a human hair or about the same size as human cells. They are soft like human cells too and can be controlled wirelessly. Philip Harder is a PhD student working on the project. We have gold nanoparticles inside the robots, and with a laser, which we can see here, we can heat certain areas of the robot. I'll let the video run for a moment. Then when we point the laser in the direction of the robot, we can see that it starts to move. And so we can then move it within the cell clusters and move it to other locations and then look at several cells in different ways. Erskele Edelman said the micro-robots aren't ready to help cancer patients just yet, but that the technology is supporting research already underway. The more we find out about these cells, the more, um, the better we can actually design therapeutics.